What's up, dude? Cool here, and in today's video, we're back with another tier list. Tuesday, okay? So, as y'all know, last Friday, Drake's for all the dogs came out. So that's what we doing today. We looking at Drake's for all the dogs. Now, before we get to the tier list, let me explain what tier list Tuesday is for those of y'all that do not know. Tier list Tuesday is whenever everybody in the cooling community comes together. Um, definitely not every Tuesday, bro. It's been two months since the last Tuesday. You know, if I have a suggestion or if something interesting pops up and we do a, decide to do a tier list, it's going to be that following Tuesday, all right? And we just rank stuff usually S to D. Sometimes I'll make a tier list. Most of the times I find one like this one I found. But let's get into it, right? So off the muscle, we got Drew Picasso. Okay, no. This is B. I felt like... I felt like a lot of the songs on this album sounded the same, bro. Like I like the singing songs. I didn't feel like this was anything special. That type of stuff is just like it's just B to me. So same thing with members only. Nothing special to me. What would Pluto do? I'll put it A, to be honest with you. I wouldn't put it in my playlist though. It seems kinda like just like once again, it doesn't seem like there's much going on with it, but it it's a song, bro. It's it's definitely a song. I think it's I think it's pretty okay. But I wouldn't want to be constantly listening to it. All the parties, another B, nothing really special. 8 a.m. is Charlotte. I'll put that A. Once again, not in my playlist. But that's because this song just isn't my type of music. I don't really care for that type of stuff. But you know, I can I can see that it's good. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know. BBL Love Interlude. I'll put it A, honestly. I just thought it was really funny and I thought it was I thought it was pretty good. Gently, I'll put B because just speaking of Spanish, Bad Bunny's on it. Uh, I don't listen to the type of music for one. For two, I have no idea what Bad Bunny is saying. But he he, uh, he does have a nice flow. So, you know, I can't really rate his performance properly. So, you know, it is what it is with that. We got Rich Baby. Daddy. <laughs> I'll put this A. This would be an S tier song if the person, you know, if Sexy Red wasn't doing the hook. If she wasn't on the song, bro, this is an S tier song. I'm not going to hold you. The beat was really good. The singing from SZA was good. Drake had a pretty good verse. Like, it was a good song, bro. She ruined it, in my opinion. Another Late Night. I believe this is the one with um, Lil Yachty. I'll put it B. A lot of people really like this song. I don't think it's anything special. Like, I mean, it sounds different, but, like, I don't really care for it, bro, to be honest with you. Virginia Beach, S tier. He started off with some really good songs off the, off the, off the muscle, okay? um amenities I, okay the song is just called amen <laughs> but amenities hey i'll put it a i liked it i liked the singing the singing was nice tried our best i put a i enjoyed this one i feel like this one sounded a little bit different than his other singing songs you know what i'm saying because like i was saying a lot of songs sound the same but i feel like this one this one had a little bit of di we got screw the world interlude this is not even a Drake song. It's just like a, a DJ Screw beat, I think. And I don't know, like the like a lot of the songs he's talking about Houston and stuff. I know he's moving there, but like, bro, the heck, bro? You don't got to make the album about that. <laughs> like, what? The, it, you know, I'll put it B because once it like once again, like I said, it's not a Drake song. It's just a DJ Screw beat, but it is a nice beat. I won't lie, but it's, it's, it's not even a song, bro. <laughs> we got calling for you. Now this is another song. I'll put it A tier. This could have been an S tier song if he didn't have that two minute part with the girl just talking, bro. Like nobody wants to listen to that. You know what would have made this song S tier? If he instead of having that girl talking, if he himself had another verse, or this would have been the perfect song to slip Travis Scott in. This would have been like an S plus song if he slipped Travis Scott in. Drake could have went. Then the rest of the time the girl was talking, he could have had Travis Scott. And then Twenty One Savage could have popped in and delivered that crazy verse that he did, bro. That junk was top tier. Honestly, a lot of people are saying J. Cole had the best verse on this album. I think it's honestly a toss-up between him and 21 Savage. That junk was like, bro, that was that was crazy, bro. You can't lie. That was insanely hard, bro. But anyway, let's keep moving. We got Fear of Heights. I think this is another one that I had in S tier. We got Daylight. Daylight is the one that his son is on. Uh, the song was pretty. I'll put an A tier. I'll put an A tier. Let me go ahead and put it in there. The only reason it's not S tier, I really like this beat selection on this album, to be honest with you. I really like the beat, and I did enjoy his verse. It's just, the song is already short. It's like 2 minutes and 45 seconds or something. And then you give, and then he gave his son like a 30 second part where he's just saying the same thing over and over again. And I don't understand, like, 
it's just silly. It's his son. You know, it's not nothing serious. But, like, you really look at it, bro. Like, you look at it as a song, bro. It can't be S tier. Like, it just it just isn't, bro. That, that, that messed it up. But, hey, man. Uh, first person shooter, I'll put A tier. This would be S tier. J. Cole's verse was ridiculous. Drake had a really, I really, I really like the the song. Like the song was S tier until the B switch. I didn't enjoy the B selection. The verse was okay, but like the first, the first half, bro. All Drake, all what Drake was doing on that beat, and then what J Cole did, that that was some S tier stuff, bro. So it's really like A plus. You know what I'm saying? It's not S, but it's A plus. IDGAF. This is C tier, bro. This is probably one of the worst songs on the album. And you know, and you know what? A lot of people really enjoy this song. You're like, bro, he carried Drake. That's crazy. He carried Drake on his own album, on his own song. No, no, he didn't, bro. If you guys can tell me in the comments without looking on Genius, what on earth the Yeet is saying? Hey, bro, I, 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 y'all, y'all can have my wallet, bro. I don't, <laughs> I don't know, bro. That man was talking, and I could not understand what he was saying. I had to listen to the song three times, and I wasn't even like paying attention to nothing. I wasn't paying attention to the beat. I wasn't paying attention to the flow. I was fully locked in on what words he was saying. That I was only then able to barely understand what he was saying, bro. The hook, I could understand what he was saying. But whenever he started, like, when his verse started, he was like, <laughs> like, bro, I, I can't, dude. Drake delivered a verse that just wasn't that good to me on this song either. The beat was really good, bro. The beat is what carried this song. I didn't really like Drake's verse. I thought the hook was all right. I'm not going to lie to you. I, I thought the hook was all right. But Yeet's actual verse was terrible because you don't know what he's saying. So the only reason this song is not B is because of the beat. I'm not going to lie to you. The beat was pretty freaking good. But the rest of the song, bro, I don't, I don't know, bro. Uh, this song, this had a uh, Tizo touchdown. I put it B. You know, some nice little singing at the end. I, I can't remember if he was rapping or not. But I think, once again, it was one of those songs where it's just kind of like... You know, it's just Drake, bro. It's like the same stuff he's been having for like his last three albums. The songs kind of sound the same, like nah, 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 you know what I'm saying. So long, y'all. I've been I've been trying to see if I want to put this A or B. I think I'll put it A, bro. Because once again, I feel like Drake he didn't do anything special. Scissor sounded pretty good on it. Um, but lyrically, if you actually listen to what he's saying on this song, he was he had a few nice little bars in there. You know what I'm saying? So. This is probably what moved it up to A. I really enjoyed Scissor's part. Um, the flow that Drake was going with, I don't know. That's just this typical Drake flow. I think he need to switch it up a little bit. I mean, he does on other songs, but like the singing songs, he could like do something else the way he's singing, you know? Bahama Promises. This song is C's here, bro. A lot of people like this song, too. I didn't like the part whenever he was like, eh. Like, he would say one word and it would last like five seconds, bro. It'd be like, you know when I like, bro. You know, dude. This is not. This is not okay. <laughs> this is not okay. Obviously, it sounded better than what I was just doing. He made it make more sense, but it still wasn't like necessarily good, bro. That's that's just the thing about that one. I I, I wasn't freaking with it. Away from home. This is another B tier song. It was one of the single ones that are just like whatever. Same thing with polar opposites. Nothing special. Just whatever. You know what I'm saying? So. You know, we look, we're looking at the list, guys. Let me know what you agree, what you disagree with, what you will place where and why. And, you know, uh, once again, as per usual, I appreciate every one of y'all that pulled up to the video. Yeah, as per usual, leave in the comments what y'all want me to do for the next tier list. Um, I'm, I've, I'm out of ideas, bro. I really don't know. So, um, could get one next week. We could get one two weeks from now. I, I don't know, bro. We could, we could not get one until another major album drops or something, bro, because... I, I'm out of ideas for tier list, bro. Let me know what y'all want me to do in the comments or in the Discord. You know what I'm saying? We got the Discord going on. Uh, I, I try to link that somewhere, maybe. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. But, yeah. As per usual, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.